constructed between 1907 and 1911, this beautiful building is now 109 years old and is the only surviving city hall from its time in Western Canada. It is a national, provincial and municipal heritage resource and its rehabilitation has been one of the most significant heritage projects underway in Canada since 2016. After weathering the elements for more than a century, the sand zone was showing signs of deterioration. And in November 2015, Council approved a $34.1 million investment for its exterior rehabilitation. For the next four years, we took on an extensive scope of work with repairs to the building's foundation, all the way up to its roof and many of the structural elements in between. We also looked to see how we could provide increased protection to reduce the effects of the elements we'd have on the new sandstone. One of the most important measures we took to protect the building for future generations is mostly hidden from view. We installed a rainwater management system which is housed inside the building and connected to a weeping tile which is actually connected to the storm drains out in McLeod Trail behind us. This, this effort will protect the sandstone from water damage that occurred over the last 100 years. Since 1911, the building has housed voting, ballot counting, it's housed city councils, it's housed mayors. I understand more than 20 mayors and hundreds of city councillors have had their offices in this place. It's been our seat of democracy for that long. Ultimately, this building belongs to all of us. It is ours. It has stood on this corner. It has seen innumerable changes to the city of Calgary. It's seen celebration. It's seen protest. It's seen building. It's seen people coming here from every corner of the earth. It's seen us in more recent times fully embracing and acknowledging the Indigenous history of this land. And it will see generations and generations of Calgarians left to go. So with that, I am proud to officially announce Historic City Hall reopened.